Good morning Aries, welcome to your general reading. This is a Sun, Moon, Rising reading. My name's Clive, you're watching Emery's Tarot. So, without further ado, I'm here to channel messages from the universe to you through my angels and spirits and guides. It's a great pleasure. Everybody's welcome. So, here we go. Energies and messages for the sign of Aries. Well, it would seem you're trying to prioritise Aries, but you've got a lot going on at the moment. There's, I'm getting a lot of conflictual thinking energy going on with you. Okay, you're trying to maintain balance. There's, you are very busy with work, your home life. Okay. But I'm getting here that there is a particular relationship that is taking a lot of time and energy with you. All right, you're trying to avoid confrontation with this person. All right, I'm. I'm also feeling that with this person. You have stopped communication. Okay, there you're being greatly distracted at the moment. All right. I'm possibly getting here that you feel that until you're ready, you will not act. Okay. For the simple reason is, you there's a big decision for you, and you're not going to act until you've got some kind of a surety. You... <coughs> You want to avoid a confrontation. I'm kind of getting you trying to avoid arguments here. Okay, let's see what your energy is at the moment. The lovers, yep, making choices. There is a particular connection here that you do want to move on. Okay, but you feel there's, the choices within this relationship are very complicated. Okay, there's possibly a... Well, I'm getting a third party. Okay. You're trying to come up with some very creative ideas. It's like you're trying to inject new life. Hmm. I'm getting here... If someone trying to coerce your judgment here. But you're not letting that happen. You're remaining steadfast. Wow. Poss possibly dealing with another fire sign. Okay. This person is very heavily in your thoughts you see them as very very impulsive maybe they're a bit of a player okay what i mean by that is they're non-committal perhaps because they're involved with other people okay you know family there's there's work going on perhaps this person travels a lot but what i'm, what I'm getting is here you're you're certainly trying to ignore the temptation here I'm getting here communication coming in wanting a meeting or wanting a conversation to take place. Wow, what's their energy? What's this person's energy that you're dealing with? Mm, Queen of Swords. Mm. They're very, very independent, strong-minded, strong-willed. Okay, they want to talk to you. They want, and kind of get in there, there's an honest conversation here taking place. Hmm. There's a few trust issues here. I'm feeling this person wants to stop doing whatever it is they were doing in the past. This player type energy, this this impulsive energy. Hmm. 
there's certain situations they're trying to cut out of their life. Hmm, it's the near future. Oh, a fresh start, you know, bringing everything to a head. Very passionate communication. It's like in the past this person was in and out of your life very infrequently. From your point of view, a bit like a jumping jack. Now, that's not a judgment to all cross watchers, okay? I'm just the messenger. I'm saying what I see here. Some very, very erratic. You're certainly trying to avoid confrontation areas. You're, so, you're trying to avoid contact with this person until you've sorted some stuff out, got it straight in your head. Okay, you're perhaps in another connection. But it would seem somebody is pursuing you. They, you you're trying to keep them at arm's length. Wow. What's your intention? Wow, a truthful conversation. I'm getting a conversation now. I'm not really honestly sure what's going on here in particular, because of, this is a general reading. But what I will say is that either you or the person you're dealing with is in another situation, or you're both in situations, okay? You're both dealing with other people. And what I'm getting is here a really truthful, honest conversation. It's a bit of a stunted relationship because of involvements elsewhere. The person you're dealing with wants to come and tell you the truth. Okay, They are trying to cut something out of their life or somebody. Uh, and they, your person wants to come and be very, very honest with you. Okay, I'm getting a conversation here. Very honest. In relation to what is achievable and what is not. What's the energy between you? Yeah. Moon card. Very, very complicated situation. Very, very challenging. Mm. It's like you turned your back on somebody because of a third party areas. But they want to come back in. You're trying to resist. They want to. They want to be really honest. They're, they're a very, very strong willed, strong individual. Okay. They don't mind being alone. They're very, very intelligent. They do want to talk to you intelligently i'm not picking up much emotion here there's a lot of tension there's a lot of passion here what are their intentions well they want to focus okay they want to overcome the differences between you two all right it's as if they're trying to cut somebody or something out of their life they want to focus with you but I'm still picking up a very non-committal energy. Some ongoing energy for you too. Oh yeah, I'm trying to manifest a connection here. Somebody here trying to reassure you, or the reassurance that that you can have a good connection, but non-committal. I'm picking up the level of this relationship, stroke connection. I'm kind of getting it's very kind. It's it's been very erratic in the past. I'm kind of getting a smoother run in the future, but on a non-committal basis because of outside influences, money, work, distance, other people. Perhaps there's a marriage here or a long-term connection. 
but your energy is one of choices okay There's this kind of fear and commitment. Mm, because of because of the history. This is all about <laughs> where there's been silence between you and somebody. I'm kind of getting there's this readiness to open up and tell the truth. It's full of self confidence. But at the end of the day, my Aryan friends, it's up to you. You've got a very big decision to make about how to take this forward. But I'm not picking committal. Not yet. Thanks very much for watching.